Hello, welcome to the McGuffey's online tutor. Today's lesson comes from the third eclectic reader, lesson 17. What the minutes say. Let's begin. Let me tell you the definitions for measuring time. Because, today's reading, which is a poem, is about time. There are 60 seconds in one minute, 60 minutes in one hour, 24 hours in one day. A day is defined in the Bible, as having both a morning and an evening. 365 days is a common year, 366 days is a leap year. A leap year occurs every four years, adding a day to February. There are 100 years in a century, 10 years in a decade. There are 7 days in a week, 4 weeks in a month, and 12 months in a year. In total, a solar year contains approximately 365 days, 5 hours, 48 minutes and 46 seconds. Today's lesson is this poem. What the minutes say, we are but minutes little things. Each one furnished with sixty wings, with which we fly on our unseen track, and not a minute ever comes back. We are but minutes. Use us well, for how we are used we must one day tell. Who uses minutes, has ours to use. Who loses minutes, whole years must lose. God defined day, because he is the creator, and he defined day by saying, morning and evening, is one day. Now you see how important time really is. It's no wonder the Mayans and the Egyptians were so fascinated with time. But let's get one fact straight, God governs all time, but man cannot, no matter how hard we try, we will never govern or control time. You must remember, we are bound by time, so we should not waste it. But God on the other hand, is not bound by time, for he created it. He is outside of time. I will give you, an easy poem to help you remember the days of the month. Here we go. 30 days of September, April, June and November, all the rest have 31, except for February, the lazy one. If you remember this short poem, you will have no problem remembering the number of days in each month. Before I end this lesson, let's hear what the minutes say one more time. We are but minutes little things. Each one furnished with sixty wings, with which we fly on our unseen track, and not a minute ever comes back. We are but minutes. Use us well, for how we are used we must one day tell. Who uses minutes? has ours to use. Who loses minutes, whole years must lose. Well, this is the end of our lesson, and I hope you visit us again, at the McGuffey's online tutor, dot com, for more lessons and worksheets. Goodbye.